Glass node, a top on-chain resource, revealed Ethereum's on-chain activity is revealing its automated alert system indicating a significant valuation milestone. The realized capitalization of Ethereum has reached $181 billion according to Glass node. Notably, the figure marks its peak over the previous eight months. The market chart that accompanied the tweet also demonstrated that the realized cap for ETH had been on an upward trend since January 2023. The realized cap was over $190 billion as of November 2022. However, it experienced a sharp decline and fell below $170 billion in just two months. In order to put things in perspective, realized cap is a metric that calculates the total value of all Ethereum tokens that have been moved on-chain in the last 12 months. By taking into account the price of a coin at the time of its last transaction rather than its current value, the metric, according to Glassnode, assigns value to each unspent transaction output UTXO. With the introduction of its cryptocurrencies hub, renowned American payment company PayPal has made another advancement in the field of digital assets. Users can interact with various crypto assets including Bitcoin and Ethereum using this feature. The action was taken just one week after the launch of PYUSD, the company's native stablecoin that is backed one ratio one by the US dollar. PayPal has updated its terms and conditions to provide users with insights into using the cryptocurrencies hub to explore digital assets. The company, which began in October 2020, expanded its services to enable users to buy, sell and hold assets in their accounts. In March 2021, it expanded its crypto services, allowing customers to check out at other online businesses using cryptocurrency. PayPal's Cryptocurrencies Hub aims to facilitate the seamless buying and selling of cryptocurrencies, enabling users to use the proceeds from their crypto transactions to purchase through the platform. The feature will be integrated with users' existing accounts and enable swift conversations between PYUSD and various digital assets. Bad actors attacked the DeFi project Zunami protocol on August 13, causing a loss of $2.1 million, according to estimates. An additional victim has been added to the list of protocols impacted by the recent attack on Curve Finance. Zunami, a decentralized revenue aggregator project that lets users take stable coins for yield. PeckShield, a blockchain security company, discovered the exploit first and immediately notified Zunami. PeckShield claims that the attack, which brought in $2.1 million and counting for the bad guy, was carried out using price manipulation made possible by contributing to the protocol. A $2 million profit was made by a hack that drained the Z-stable spools on Curve Finance, manipulating the price of Zunami Ether and Zunami USD. PeckShield alerted Zunami Protocol, which confirmed the attack and advised users to avoid purchasing affected tokens. The collateral backing USD is alleged safe, but Zunami's website claims one of the collateral holders is Curve, raising questions about the viability of those reserves. In the upcoming segment, we will update you about the following news. Creator-friendly NFT marketplace Omi launches on Gempad. Solana NFTs outshine Cardano NFT buyers up by 2226.47%. Coca-Cola unveils masterpiece NFT collection on Ethereum layer 2 base. Stay tuned for more updates.